Good Sunday morning, everybody. This is breakfast. It is half a cup. Well, these muffins are six points. And how I did that was, how I've always been doing it, or how I've been doing it the past couple weekends. It's half a cup of the Kodiak cake mix with just about a half a cup of water. And then I added a quarter cup of the Jimmy Dean turkey sausage crumbles. Um, the crumbles are one point, the pancake mix is five points. And then this is one and a half fluid ounces of this syrup for zero points. So this is six, banana zero two. I'm not really gonna have coffee today, I'm not feeling like it, so six points for breakfast. Hello friends, I haven't talked to you in a while today. I've been trying to figure out my calligraphy <laughs> project an issue but it is 240 and I'm gonna have lunch um, so I'm going to have one of the servings of the one pot kielbasa pasta that I made this past week this is eight points so that's what I'm gonna have for lunch I already have my chipotle tracked and I had 12 points with dinner tracked so now I have four points left um, and hopefully that will Give me some Halo Top cookie dough at the end of the night. Yeah. Okay. See you later. I am on my way to get Chipotle for dinner. It is 6.55, so I have my car light on because it is dark outside. But you just saw me do day, man, and I told myself I was going to remember this, 41 and 42 of Bikini Body Mommy, lower and also cardio because I did not work out yesterday, so I had to do a double. And after I finished lower, I was like, I don't know if I'm gonna do a double. <laughs> just cause, I don't know. I just wasn't feeling like the energy and whatever, but I did it and I'm really proud of myself that I did it and I just, you know, pushed through it because it went by fast. It wasn't, you know, didn't hurt me to do it. So I'm glad that it's done so that I'm back on um, schedule for tomorrow. Um, I can't believe we're already like 40 something days in. That is cray cray exciting. We're almost halfway done actually. 45 will be halfway. So that's cool. Um, let's see. I finished one half of my calligraphy project today. 
gonna have to do place cards for rehearsal dinner and also menu on all of the menus. So I did all the place cards, but it is it was not a good experience because the paper is like, I don't know if soft is the right word, but the nib and the ink and the paper combo was just not good. It was really troublesome. So that is all right. Um, well, not all right. Sorry, I just got a message on my phone and it totally distracted me. Um, so anyway, those are done. Not my best work, but I'm doing it for free. <laughs> uh, and mo I'm like hyper critical of my work compared to somebody that has no idea, you know, what calligraphy is supposed to look like. So I'm sure it's, it's just me being a little bit extra. Um, so I had lunch that you saw and then I only have one more serving of that so I might just do that for lunch tomorrow so I can um, finish it up. But then I had some grapes um, before working out. After the workout I took Marley for a walk and I hit my 5,000 steps for the day. And then when I got home, she was having a treat, so I wanted a treat. So I had this Sinalicious Swirl, a bag of that for two points. So that means I have two points left for my day after dinner. Um, so I'll probably go into my weeklies a little bit for some ice cream, but that is okay. I'm pretty sure I have weeklies left. I tracked um, most of what I had for dinner yesterday. I just have to try and track the chips and the queso. I, I, that's gonna be guessing and I don't know, but I'm gonna try. Um, so I know that I still have, I know that I still have weekly after I tracked, um, you know, the, my main dinner, which was a taco salad, a beef taco salad, and I didn't eat all of it. Um, and I also asked for, it typically comes with refried beans, beef, lettuce, tomato, um, sour cream and guac. So I just told them to put the sour cream on the side because I don't really love sour cream like that and I didn't miss it. It was fine. So I'm glad I saved the points doing that because I didn't even touch it on the side. I didn't even add it. So I'm really glad I took it off. Um, and it was really good, but I know I left some of it. It also comes in like a crispy flour tortilla shell. So to figure out the points for that, I know Qdoba has one of those. So I went on Qdoba's website, got the nutrition information, put it into the calculator, and tracked it, tracked half, because I ate half. So I was proud of that too, because I could have just been like, eh, I'll just, you know, whatever. Um, another proud, I'm just having such a proud day today. Um, I also put the sour Skittles in the kitchen safe. Um, I had a weak moment yesterday and I bought some jelly beans and I ate them, but I put that bag in the kitchen safe as well. Carissa, it was all her fault. She, she snapped me or something. and was like, when you realize that jelly beans are back, like, because it's Easter season. So now jelly beans are back in stores. Mm. So I was just happened to be at the right place at the right time when she sent that. I was in Walmart. I was walking past the Easter candy and I got a bag of the Starburst Fave Reds. Oh my gosh. Ugh. But they're making my stomach hurt and I was still eating them. Like what is, what is my problem? I know somebody understands what I'm talking about, but like what? So all day today I was like, man, I'm mad that I put those things in the kitchen safe and that's when you know you need a kitchen safe. And it was a good idea that you did it. Because if you're mad that you put it there so that you can't have it, it it's good that it's there. Uh, but now I'm taking up both kitchen safes because I locked up the jelly beans at a different time. <laughs> Chad's going to come home and be like, what happened? Mm. Um, so yeah, that's today. What else? What else? What else? What else? Nothing. I can't think of anything. Yeah. 
I'm getting my list together for Simply Filling. Um, let's see. I'm trying to think. Grits, like butter grits, are not Simply Filling. But grits plain are. So I'm going to have to get grits plain and add some like butter that's zero points into it. Like the spray butter or I can't believe it's not butter light, but um, not a points worth. I don't think that's Simply Filling. And I'm going to have to get a different kind of, I'm going to have to get fat-free milk, which is fine. That's the milk I drink anyway. If I were to drink milk, I don't typically. Um, it's really just the milk I would have if I were eating cereal. Um, and even then it's just like to wet it. I don't drink from the, I think that's so like uncouth to drink like from the bowl. I don't know. I've never done it. Um, and the only problem, well not problem, my, my yogurt parfaits, the yogurt is simply filling, but the Kashi Golden Crunch is not. So I'm going to have to get some Cheerios, darn it, and um, use that as my granola substitute, which is totally fine. Totes fine. I've done that before. So, no problemo. Um, grits. I don't think the English muffins I have are Simply Filling. I'll have to check. That would be great if they were because I have another whole package. Um, I'm excited to make like hamburgers that are Simply Filling. I can't wait. I haven't had a hamburger, like a cheeseburger at home in a really long time. Not felt like, I don't want to say guilty about it, but I don't know not felt like it was worth it because it was higher in points or something maybe I don't really know what I'm trying to say there but I'm excited to have that um, one night for dinner the whole french fry thing I'm just going to cut up some potatoes and cook them in the oven boom fries um, I know that there are some packaged french fries that are like potatoes and dextrose or potatoes and whatever um, and those are not simply filling because of the extra thing that they added in there so you have to be careful when you're looking at that stuff but there are a lot of rules with simply filling I was not aware and this group that I'm in it's called simply filling uh, hyphen my Weight Watchers plan of choice I think is what it's called and these ladies are no nonsense which I can appreciate because sometimes if I get like if I okay I'm gonna be real with you guys if I get a question about something in a video that I say in the video I answer the question in the video like just as an example how much Kashi Golene Crunch is two points and I have said in my video, I'm using a quarter cup for two points. Like if I were to get that question, how much Kashi Golden Crunch can you have for two points? I get irritated with that because that means you're, you're not listening, you know? And I just, I'm not a, a person that uh, loves to repeat myself. So anyway, but these ladies are like <laughs> cutthroat, no nonsense. I just imagine they're sort of like, you know. I don't, I, I don't know, but, um, they're like, uh, if somebody asks a question, did you check the list? Did you ask a person? It says clearly on the list that this is da, 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 da. I was like, damn, <laughs> they are, they need business, which again, I can appreciate. They're, they're like, you know, that happens to me at work too. Someone will ask me something about a policy, like a specific thing about a policy that I would have to look up the policy to find the answer and they ask me the question when they can look up the policy to get the answer. It's like, so you don't want to waste your time, but you want to waste my time. Is that what we're talking about here? So I just tell them, I would, I don't know, I would have to look up the policy. So that means that they should be doing that because why ask me a question and make me do something that you can do? I just don't like middle, the whole middleman uh, practice. I don't like that. <laughs> oh, well, I, I went on a huge tangent. So I will, um, see you guys. I'll show you my Chipotle later. Bye. 
Alrighty guys, here is dinner. This is my Chipotle. I get a barbacoa bowl with white rice, which is six points. Barbacoa is three points. Cheese is four points. So this is 12 points. No, 13 points. Hold on. Six, nine, 11. What? <laughs> Hold on a second. You guys, I think I'm losing brain cells. Okay. The rice is six, the barbacoa is three, so that puts us up to nine. The cheese is four, that puts us up to 13. This is 13 points. It has mild salsa and lettuce on there for zero. Then I have three tablespoons of the Trader, oh my lord, this has been happening to me in my daily life all day. Okay. Reduced guilt, chunky guacamole, three tablespoons is one point, so we're up to 14 points, and then I'm gonna have you can have up to 20 of the baked scoops for four points. So I'm having 20, girl. So we are at 18 points for dinner. Like I said before, I still have two points left after this. I will see you later. Y'all, I'm just like overwhelmed, overwhelmed, no. Overall, underwhelmed with Chipotle today. It was just like lacking flavor. And usually I love their mild salsa, but it have like zero kick to it was just like it just felt like tomatoes like they missed something i don't know maybe they didn't put lime juice in or something i have no idea but the barbacoa felt like unseasoned lame my guac and chips was gr were great though hmm. see ya is daddy home <gasps> oh go get him go get him where is he Hello friends, closing out the vlog for Sunday. Um, you saw dinner, I did have some Halo Top after dinner, so I do still actually have weeklies left because I haven't tracked the candy and I don't plan on tracking the candy. <laughs> I mean, to be 100% honest, I don't plan on it. Um, I mean, because I don't plan on needing weeklies this week. So, I don't know, whatever. It's just gonna go into my fit points and like what, that's more like just for me to see, but I think I'll be okay. So, um, that's really it. I had Halo Top and we went to bed. I haven't watched This Is Us yet. I haven't watched, well, Victoria was a rerun. Um, my nail polish came off today. I don't know what the heck, so I have to redo it. Mm, that's it. So I hope you guys had a good weekend. I'm so sad that it's Monday. Ugh. But I will see you later for Monday's vlog. Bye.